tray is full of ash and cigar stubs. Yes, it is. Thank you, Sherlock. Newspaper articles on horse racing, hmm. hurdles, steeplechase, and flat racing. He is a true enthusiast, yeah, true Holmes. Gambler. Betting slips for horse racing. The sums are quite impressive. It can be an expensive vice. This man had probably used all his savings. A telegraph. Holmes, look. There's a flooded area over here. Hmm. I believe that the flooded area might be worth checking. Railway post bags. This post bag belongs to the station master. What you got for me, dog. Letters to the wife. Letters to the lawyer. Oh, shit. The station master appears to have found himself in some yeah. financial trouble. That's for sure. Sitting. Good day to you, sir. My name is Sherlock Holmes. Good day to you, sir. My name is Sherlock Holmes, and this is Dr. John Watson. We are investigating the case of the vanished train. Is that so? Well, good day, gentlemen. I am Mr. Duff, the station master of this station. I'll be happy to help you in any way I can, but. There's not much that I can tell you about last really, night. Really, no. Nothing at all, huh? S uh, sneaky son of a bitch. It appears that you may be at risk of some flooding along the line here. You mean that the whole bloody lake is at our feet? Quite so. But it is strange, because according to my map, there should be a quarry here, and behind that, the lake. How should I know? I only arrived here a few months ago. And where did you work before that? Well, I was working in Nottingham. Ah, well, I asked for a quieter place, ah. so they transferred me here. Life is cheaper. I can't really complain. Did any passengers leave or board the train last night? No. I saw no one as usual. 
I reported the train's passage by telegraph. Just the same as all the other nights. I'm like, damn, she's fine. I observe that you are a gambling man, Mr. Duff. You had hoped that your relocation to this small town might have helped ease your addiction. But it was not to be. I beg your pardon. Gambling, nigga. Addiction to what? We found a number of horse racing tickets inside your office. Well, well, we all have our weaknesses. An expensive obsession, surely, for a station master. It is none of your business. I occasionally attend the races with my colleagues. And anyway, that's my private life. Fucker. There was a gentleman of Mexican origin, I believe, in the waiting room. Did you notice him? What? A Mexican? Here in the back of beyond? Are you quite sure about that? Yes, you dick. Goodbye, sir. It is obvious that we cannot inspect the quarry. Instead, we can check the beach area around the flooded oh. lake. Watson, it seems that both South American companies were involved in the purchase of the mine. The man at Doncaster who fled our approach, he smokes Mexican cigars. Perhaps... Yes, Watson. Yep. We should perhaps certainly speak someone. with him. A suspect? Perhaps he's not. Who fucking knows? Because this game gets confusing more and more. I'm not choosing nothing. Here we go. Okay. Uh, let's see. Hell? Son of a bitch. Okay, so...
This railway branch should lead to the quarry. Let us take... The switch is rusted, but it still works. The rail is rusted and looks old, but the railway is still usable. The railway ends here. That is strange. Um, to go to the beach. Beachy time, beachy time, beachy, 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 beachy time. Oh yeah. It's a motherfucking closer. Mother, mother, motherfucking closer. I don't know what I'm singing anymore. I'm so tired. Sometimes you just gotta go with it. Here we are at the beach that is located near the quarry and Doncaster station. It doesn't You matter, really have to just go with it. Rest. Oh man. I can't believe how low I'm talking. No, I mean, dog. Yeah, you know what I mean. These traces were made by a carriage. Look. The vehicle pressed this stone into the ground. It would have been quite heavy. The vehicle pressed this stone into the ground. It would yeah, have been no quite kidding. heavy. The distance between the tracks is about six feet, seven inches. The vehicle would have been heavy no as these tracks are quite deep. These traces are relatively fresh and were made by a large truck loaded with materials. The traces found at the disassembled shed near Evesham and at the lake were you from the same vehicle. Say. Seriously, bro? Damn, she's fine. Wonder when she'll be mine. She walked past like press rewind and see that at one more time, and I got this one up. Observing the coastline and the moored boats, we are able to see that the lake's water level dropped. The lake has flooded the quarry. The dam was Clearly. probably breached. Oh, look, metal plate. 